Excellent. So we're going to get a little taste of the song that was, it's Sucks. called Sucks and Blows. Yeah, so it's when Bart Simpson is, is watching his sister's school recital and he says, I didn't think it was possible for something to both suck and blow. This episode is being supported by Tape It. If you currently use voice notes to record your ideas, you should try Tape It instead. The first lines, like that, that first melody, that bit... The last dream of every dying soldier was from the very first night we ever like tried to write songs together, which is when he played me France and I played him Albion in, in its earliest form and we tried to write a song together and this was it, but it was never finished. We just had that couple of lines. So this song dates back to the verses, then. 27 the, 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 years ago. Those lines, the wow. last dream of every dying soldier. That is amazing. Yeah. And then it went into a different, another song called Albert, which was completely different. And so we took it out, but I don't happen to that. Oh, and, the, and the good old days as well was, was around that time parts of that anyway yeah, that, that, so the very first like, so immediately it's a bit of a, an emotional bolt hearing those lines it takes you back and how it sort of went forgotten for all them years and then just popped up I here think it's we... like a, a lot of these little things we, we did years ago was so, was, was so I don't know it's just you know, in, in our minds but they're so strong and over the years there have been little, like little birds pecking at the window and I think um and I think it's the same way. Even music when the lights go out was a little bird pecking at the window, and it was, it was always an afterthought to put it on the record. And um, and I, yeah, I, I, there are still quite a few birds out there pecking, aren't there? But that's definitely one of them. It's great. I mean, it's great that they keep keep pecking, <laughs> and it's great that these these things, these seeds, still stay with you. That you can somehow, I mean, maybe miraculously out of nowhere it returns to you and you think, oh, maybe we should explore that again. So that's what happened with Shiver then. Suddenly. The, the very, well, that, that came in the end, but there's been, there's been a couple of other um, versions of this. So, well, one of the songs we did do in Jamaica was called Shiver, but you wouldn't recognise it. Um, I don't know if you're going to play it. That's the one we've got the demo of. Oh, we got you but said the, it. But the, the, the only part of that in, in the current incarnation is the middle eight. So we took the verses from the demo to, to hear the middle eight. Right. So another song called Shiver you came up with wrote, in Jamaica. Yeah, in Jamaica. Yeah. Um, we'll, we'll, can we play a bit of that? The late lazy day on the hill. Yeah, man. King well, of the hill. There we were. Top and tail Arcadia. I want to be nostalgic for being hopelessly poor, but I shiver when I think of those dreams. All right, yeah. So if you play the um, if you play the middle the middle eight from the new one, you'll hear the uh, you hear that. It's interesting to think that, you know, so that just the middle eight from that song from Jamaica, that survives to go into this. No, the, the rest verse, of the it verse, was... The verse from the song in Jamaica is the middle eight of the new song. Yeah. Right, right. I okay. follow, follow, it, yeah. follow it, John. Is yeah, it... I'm, I'm trying, I'm trying. <laughs> but have you got the demo of the... Your de we had a song called Your Demo Sucks and Blows. Oh, yeah. Have you got that? Well, I, I will listen to this. Oh, yeah. If you, like so many of our guests, use voice notes to capture your ideas, you will love Tape It. It's the iPhone recording app designed specifically for musicians and songwriters. With Tape It, you can record straight from your lock screen, set markers, add notes, and even include photos of settings. Plus, there's cloud sync, you can import your old voice notes, and to stay on top of it all, Tape It has great labeling features like automatic instrument detection. And all of the above is free. If you currently use voice notes, switching to Tape It is a no-brainer. And there's more. If you upgrade to Tape It Pro, it uses two microphones on your iPhone, along with gentler dynamic compression, to give a much more natural sound than any of the usual apps. And we have a huge offer for you. 50% off Tape It Pro if you upgrade now. Just go to the app and use the promo code Tape Notes, or click the link in the description below. It's sucks, really beautiful that, that, and demo, that demo shiver man. It's yeah, so, it is. Yeah, I mean, and it's, words, a, it's a whole song as well. It's um, I don't, the whole song's beautiful. I yeah, mean, it yeah. almost feels like a sort of illegitimate son who's been denied, or a legitimate son who's been denied access to the record. But I wouldn't mind playing that in its entirety at some point. Yeah, it's very strange. Wow. Basically, it was the pretty much shiver as it is now, but with completely different lyrics, completely different theme, um, and 
Dimitri was just appalled. So were Gary and John. They were like, there's no way you can... They said, they said, like... They was a bit silly. Guys, we need some lyrics. We need lyrics now. I was like, are we able to do this song? We said, give us five minutes. We're fine. We we decamped to the studio too. And um, we and then, and then we, we 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 found something that we thought was wonderful. We touched upon yeah. something really true, and we came back to play it to everyone else. And the stony faces that. So I thought I thought you know what? I believe in this. I'm going to stand my ground. You know, like, and I got a part in this band, to say the least, and uh, didn't stand my ground for very long, did well, I? I, well, well, I, I, stood, I? I stood I stood our ground for a little bit, and then I was on your own. But, yeah, that was a very frosty reception. Have, have you got it? Or do you want to play it on the acoustic? Oh, I've not got it. I'm afraid. Yeah, so I... like, oh, that's too good. <laughs> Excellent. So we're going to get a little taste of the song that was, it's called Sucks and Blows. Yeah, so it's when Bart Simpson is, is watching his sister's school recital and he says, I didn't think it was possible for something to both suck and blow. <laughs> <laughs> so it's the same chords as this. How's it going? Well, I was sat in seven dials, just thinking on my woes, but there appeared a cat like child. Walking on her toes She said you are an indie prince Would you listen to my demo So I listened to the demo But the demo sucks and blows It goes on like that like One freezing cold morning in Cologne Walking outside the tour bus And appeared a chicken punk With fuzz under his nose He said you are an indie ubermensch would you listen to my demo? <laughs> so I listened to his demo. Sucks and blows. Yeah. And to think they looked at you aghast <laughs> when you played that to them. I, I can't believe it. I thought it was quite sweet. I would love it. I think it's great. But but so what happened then? If, if and so then the like, song had nowhere to yeah, go, really, because yeah. it had all these different parts pulling and we didn't just know what it was about. Then we got the happy hardcore. And then, yeah, the happy hardcore piano bit. <laughs> <laughs> and that sort of brought it all as all back right. to focus point with happy hardcore who's play you play that round and round for about ten minutes. Um and and suddenly you felt you were back on track. Yeah, it was something I think so. it, 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 Yeah, it, this this song didn't it, for me it's one of the strongest songs on the album, but for a long time I I couldn't see it making the album because it just didn't and then it all just sort of came together with these different parts and it's a really beautiful song, it means a lot to me this song. Yeah. yeah. It, it, but it, I didn't have much it, hope for it. It's like a wayward child that you just think, I don't know what, I've given it everything I can, but if that's how it's going to be, that's how it's going to be. And then he comes back and he's like, he's now got like an international like um, ice cream company that's making fortune. What, Mr. Shiver? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. I mean, I felt the same. Good name for an ice cream company, though, actually. Mr. Whippy. Where's oh, me, uh, where's my post-it notes? I'm sure it is already. 